Hi, so it is 12.43 today. Wow, it's so late. I didn't even realize how late it was. And um, we are finally finished packing up the car to drive back home. But the first the initial plan is I've got the Style Hall Christmas party tonight and so we're going to that. But um, it's actually right next to the Grove because we're going to Koi. And I was like, I kind of have some Christmas shopping I have to do because there's only eight more days till Christmas. Like, I did not even realize that. So, um, yeah, you guys are probably wondering, Megan, why does your hair look so good? But basically, what I do when I've got something to do at night, but I'm like leaving the, like leaving, I have to be like kind of ready basically all day, is I will um, curl my hair like really, really tight ringlet curls, and then I will pin the two front sections back. And then before I'm ready to actually like leave and go, I will take down these two little front pin back parts, and it'll be really nice, and then I'll tease the top of it, because it's just gonna like lay really flat for now. And I think I actually put a hat on or something to kind of conceal that. But do you guys wanna see my outfit for today? I'd show you it in my closet, but my closet really does not have good lighting. So it's a little like eclectic and kind of weird, but I really like it. So I'm wearing this top from Bernie Melville. It's the California one, and I had to wear a black tank top under it, because I really wasn't ready for the exposedness. It's actually really cold in LA right now, so don't judge me and by cold I mean like 50 degrees which is really cold for me I know I'm a baby California whip and then I'm wearing these cheetah print leggings which may not be everyone's cup of tea but I really like them and I'm obsessed with cheetah print and it's not like I don't feel like it's too much because I'm wearing boots with it so they kind of go up higher and I would have worn black boots but I already packed them and then I've got my big cardigan from Brandy Melville as well. The leggings are from Windsor by the way. I got them last year and then I'm wearing my favorite boots and these are from Nine West and yeah it's just really comfy and cozy and I've got a scarf here let me show you. I've got this scarf from Windsor that's kind of like this dark burnt red color that I'll probably throw on when I get cold and my arm warmers or hand like they're like arm warmers from forever 21 and then i'm actually carrying a different purse today i am carrying my uh rebecca minkoff uh mac bag not the mini mac like the big one and this is in brown I'm wearing false lashes right now can you tell i think they're super cute because i did winged liner and i'm gonna wear red lips later for tonight and so i thought i'd just do some false lashes because my eyelashes felt kind of boring and plain but yeah, that is the plan. Oh, I just got these new earrings from Forever 21 to go with my outfit for tonight. They're really cute. And I'm pretty excited. I've just been packing and tumbling and tumbling. Not like, not like cartwheel, like tumbling. Um, and I watched the season finale of Homeland last night. Holy ball sack. It was so good and this is the one from season one so we haven't started season two yet we're gonna start season two probably tomorrow when we get back home home and I, I can't even wait I'm so excited it was so good it was an hour and a half long episode and like twists and turns and plot twists it was great yeah look at my nails aren't they so cute I'm obsessed with them except I freaking fucked up this one so bad yeah no big deal oopsies I added this hat onto my outfit. Do you guys like it? I got it from American Eagle, like super, super, super sale. And it's like this burgundy felt hat and I'm obsessed with it. Right now, I'm making some frozen veggies. Uh, it's like my go-to snack when I'm not like really hungry, but I just want to eat something. And I just made myself a cup of tea for the road. This is the vanilla Rubles, Rubles tea from Starbucks. And I bought the tin at TJ Maxx and it's really good. And I'm taking some food home that I had left here before moving out. And I've got three things of tea. This is my mom bought, like, literally the day we moved in. Green tea and then this really yummy cereal. It's like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but it's organic. And not as bad for you. So, yeah. And I got my giant owl mug full of veggies. Oh, that. And now I'm going to put some pepper on it. It's all packed up and ready to go. My little genius packer, a.k.a. my dad. <laughs> With everything in the back, you could see my pillow pet. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty excited. We are going to check my mail first to make sure I don't have any other mail like lasting here before I go to break. And then we are off to the Grove, which I'm excited for because I love the Grove. And I was telling my, I was showing my dad pictures about it like on Christmas, like online, about how it's so Christmassy right now and it's so cute. And last time I went to the Grove, I met Kyle Massey from That's a Raven, and now I've officially, aside from Eddie, met all the cast members of That's a Raven. Because one time when I was in my chubby stage, I went to like a Radio Disney like 
concerty kind of thing in like San Jose or something. And uh, they had a hula hoop contest, and Raven and Chelsea were there. And if you did the hula hoop contest, you could win. You could meet them. And um, there were like hundreds of people there, and I got chosen to do the hula hoop contest, and I won the hula hoop contest, and I met them. But I don't let any of my friends see the pictures because I was so fat and so unfortunate looking as a kid. My Raven pictures. <laughs> yeah, he's laughing at me. Let's hit the road, Jack, and don't you come back. Oh, mo, no, mo. Guys, it was a monumental moment. Not because I'm eating Freo, because I'm always eating Freo. Michelle Vaughn just treated me. I died because I was even talking about it at my meetup yesterday that I'm like literally obsessed with the video that she did with Coach. Like the one she did, like the organizing her bag thing. Like, I honestly, I am one of those people I could care less about sponsored videos. Like, I don't even care. But like, that video was literally amazing and so awesome. And like, you could tell she put so much time and effort into it. And like, I'm just obsessed with her videos. Like, she's, like, my, like, ultimate, like, favorite person I watch, like, her and, like, Tyler Oakley, obviously. But, like, I'm obsessed with her, and I tweeted that I liked her video, and she retweeted me, and then she responded with thank you, and I'm, like, shitting my pants right now, and I, like, can't breathe, and I'm so excited! Haul the snacks, Daddy. Show what we got. Bird food. Seaweed. Bird food. Edamame. <laughs> Good food. Turkey jerky. <laughs> Great food. Dark chocolate. And that's what we got for our snacks. Because we're going to be leaving at like 8. So we'll already be eating dinner. We're going to Koi tonight. Um, we've already beaten dinner. So we just need kind of like snacks to keep us awake. And then we'll stop and get like sodas and stuff. And or caffeine. I'm just going to have like a Red Bull or something. And just be like. Heck my yogurt. I got tart with raspberries, dark chocolate chips, and some almond slivers, and a little bit of peanuts, both like raw almonds and like raw peanuts. I don't know why. I don't really like peanuts, but I don't really like almonds either. But in Froyo, they kind of take away from the weird texture that they have, so I actually like it. And I went to cherry on top, which is one of my favorite ones. Um, I like I like cherry on top. I also like a lot of the other ones, so my all-time favorite one is one in my hometown, so I cannot wait to get that as soon as I get home. Straight chaos. At Nordstrom in the Grove. Can we just look at that? It's so crazy. The groovy Grove. Oh, you're so funny. I just picked out the last of Casey's gift. Hi. So, Ali and I are still trying to go by No, 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 no. We're at Maple Way. 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 We're at Holiday party, holiday party, and lots of people, y'all. I really want to. It's a start. We're going to Canada. Let's go get see ya. Hello from a rest stop in Button Willow, California. It's a bathroom, when I'm here. I changed from my pretty party address that was at the Style Hall dinner to letters, yoga pants, Uggs. And we're about, we've been driving, I've been driving, it's my turn driving. We drove for two hours, it's like four left. It's, like... it's officially daddy's turn to drive, and we stopped at Denny's for him to get a coffee. I'm exhausted, I'm so sleepy, but I'm just really cold, so right now he gave me his flannel and his other jacket, and I've got my pillow pet elephant. The trunk always looks very sexual. And yeah, I'm curling up and falling asleep listening to oh, The Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell, which um, we're listening to on tape. And it's really good. And my makeup's also on. Except I was wearing red lipstick before. That's no stuff, not there anymore. <laughs> uh, a little past 12 now. 12 midnight. And we should be getting home around 3 a.m. So, yeah, I'm just going to go straight to bed after that.